Well, hello guys. I'm just now starting my YouTube channel. I'm Russell at Bonded Oaks Acres. We're getting started. I've had a, done a few projects these last couple weeks. Kind of wish I would have videoed, but I was nervous about starting my channel. Still a little nervous about recording videos and everything like that. But the last couple days, I remodified my chicken coop. I moved my quail from outside, I mean from inside to outside, and they're loving it. I'm going to show you a little video, it ain't going to be very long, of my little homestead. We're in the process of buying more land to make it bigger, but right now this is what we got to work with, and I hope you all enjoy. Well, here's my chicken coop. I built the main part about three four years ago, and it hadn't had any chickens in it in a while. It's been sitting over here. And so I moved it in the backyard the other day and and cleaned it out, added new wire. I extended the front on, made it bigger. These chickens are just maybe maybe two months old, maybe a little less. So they're not laying yet. So we ain't letting them have free range to the yard yet, but they will be. I built a door right here on the front. You can see the handle where you can get in and access to food and water but when they start getting ready to go bigger get bigger and run out in the yard i put a little door right here with a little lock on there to keep my son out my son's real real nosy but they can free range during the day when they get old enough and then there's the quail i built this hutch a, about about a month ago the chickens have been in it for the last few weeks until I got this one fixed just what two days ago but I just moved the quail outside and they are loving it they are just having the time of their life with the more space out of their little broader from inside these are the, I, I can't say it right but the cornex quail or something like the corn cortex I've never been able to say it right but they're very docile they're so friendly i had 20 one passed away i got 19 in here and there's five males and there's 14 females are eventually going to raise them so we can eat feed our family that's my son my little helper he's always over here helping me and this is the garden that we got going on got my tomatoes zucchini eggplant some jalapenos in the back some black eyed peas and cream peas and some green beans sorry about the sun there's my zucchini and squash down that row and i got more tomato plants here coming up got a big one back there and of course in the very back along the chain link fence there there's a uh, more zucchini my wife loves zucchini i was able to get two yesterday out of the garden i planted a little late than normal due to my my work not being home a lot now i'm not working so i'm trying to be cost efficient by growing my own produce we've got a lot of cucumbers coming in a lot of squash and zucchini coming in should be ready in a few days can't wait and then of course my hoss tool plow i'm that is a lifesaver i love it especially getting in between these rows i got the the whole attachment on the bottom of it and i love it this that's it for the day ain't, ain't gonna be a very long video i'm gonna get better at it i got a drone coming so i can do some more aerial shots i ain't got a lot of land to work with right here where we're living at right now like i said we're in the process of buying six acres here in texas so i'll be able to get a lot more animals into my homestead but just please subscribe and like and uh let's go on this journey this new lifestyle that we're going to be trying to be more self-sufficient being able to grow our own vegetables have our own food you gonna say hi buddy say hi hi that's my little man he's always out here with me helping y'all have fun and thank y'all bonded o acres say bye bubba bye